So I've just fitted this LED security light, this LED floodlight, uh, to the wall, and it's 12 volt. So, uh, but what you can't get, well, it doesn't seem you can, is a 12 volt LED floodlight with a PIR. And I suppose, I suppose the reason for that is that uh, not many houses have a 12 volt power supply attached to them. But this house does, and the uh, 12 volt power supply is this big bank of batteries here. So I had to buy the PIR as a separate unit, and I found this one on uh, eBay. It was only about six pounds. It doesn't appear to be completely waterproof, so we'll see uh, how well it does when it starts to rain. But uh, what I'll do is I'll attach the battery clip. That comes on. Uh, takes a while to warm up and stabilise. So, yeah, so that's working. Now the only thing about this PIR switch is that it doesn't have a daylight sensor. Actually, it does have a position on the circuit board for one, but the CDS, the cadmium sulfide uh, resistor, uh, opto resistor, isn't fitted. So of course it, uh, it comes on during the daylight. But I don't think that's a major problem. The only thing really that's uh, in this area are the bins here. So the idea is that this would light up the bins uh, when it gets dark and of course as it's getting towards winter it will get dark earlier. So we'll see how useful it is and we'll see how long the PIR switch lasts before it all gets waterlogged.